So this is Steve, and I'm here with Christopher Guerin, who is the president of the Redevelopment Commission. Hi, Hi Appreciate Steve. Appreciate your time today. Hi. Nice to see you again. It's good to see you. Uh, kind of a good news day for Fort Great Wayne. news day mm -hmm. for Fort Wayne. The, uh, the announcement that the Harrison is moving ahead and is, will be built and that uh, leases are in place, that uh, funding is in place, is all just incredibly great news. And it may have been a little long in coming, um, given the economy and but uh, I think I think patience in this case has been has been the key that we just needed to wait things out a little bit and and certainly Barry Real Estate showed great um, commitment and good faith in the way they uh, kept at this and worked very very hard especially in the last five months when things did start to ease up and they saw some opportunities they really went after it and what we saw today in that press conference is was just a great moment for all of us. Uh, we were talking, or the commission was talking earlier about the seventy thousand dollars and returning the checks, and you had some arguments that you felt it would be, you know, kind of following good faith with good faith. Yeah, I mean, there were really there were really two issues. the the um, the seventy five thousand dollars, which basically paid for an extension of time to continue to work, was as much an issue related to the calendar and to the availability of the, the commission to meet, at least half of it was that, and just needing just a little bit more time to make, um, uh, get into writing what was already committed verbally. So it just didn't seem to me to make a heck of a lot of sense to, to um, it felt a little punitive for us to hold on to those. But the, the other side of it is that we, we, we're still wanting to see other people um, uh, invest in this to, to become renters, whether it's apartments or retail. And I think it just sends a good message to the community that, that we're, we're, a, we're a great partner, that the city is a great partner. We treat people fairly and we, uh, we're very serious about getting this done. And so we're hopeful that, that more and more in the next coming weeks, we'll find people stepping up businesses um, that, that want to be a part of this great project. And, and you had some pretty high praise there for Greg and the staff of the redevelopment. The, yeah, and I, I really should have put it as the team. I, I mentioned Greg by name, but it was really, really an incredible team effort. Um, the, the lawyers involved and the staff members and Greg, um, but, but Greg has shown an enormous amount of, of uh, diplomacy and good judgment and patience, dealing with a lot of different um, folks with a lot of different ideas and opinions. And uh, he found a way to sort of to, to, to work the middle path all the way through it, which was the path towards success, right? And, and I think the commission has supported him from day one in wanting to get this done, not, not cutting bait on on Barry Real Estate, even though that could have been very easy for us to do, you know, six months ago. Um, but at the same time, we didn't have any other visible options. We didn't have anybody lining up to do this project instead. Um, and, and Barry continued to, and I think this was a lot to do with Greg's engagement. He engaged them at every point and encouraged them and helped them. And I think they felt they had a great partner. And uh, so it's taken a lot of work on his part and the staff's part, but, uh, it, it, it's a fine moment for that department to be able to, to stand up today and say that uh, that this project is going forward. And the, the entire project is just amazing. When you yeah. start to think about uh, how quickly yeah. it came together, you, that it's there. The, what's there already is amazing. You know, the ballpark and the hotel. I mean, all of that is in the park. It's all just first rate. Um, the uh, I can't remember who it was that said that today, but but it is the, the finest um, new um, baseball um, park for for minor leagues in the country. I mean, a lot of people have said that. People um, of national stature have said that. Um, I run into people every day. I did today um, at the doctor's office. There was somebody who just went on and on and on and says, "You know, I wasn't I wasn't for this. You know, I like the Wizards and I like the." And now I love it. I go down there and there's always something going on and I go to concerts there and I go to baseball. Um, and so there's just one more convert and there have been a great many converts. Once they saw it, once they enjoyed it, they realized that, that it's a really wonderful project. And this now will just be the capstone to the whole thing. Sure. Well, Christopher, we thank you for your time today. You bet. Thanks, Steve.